Good morning. My name is John Zuccarello, and I am Chief Innovation Officer and co-founder of Grape. And we are here today to share with you our vision of a healthier human and a happier planet. And it starts right here in New York. Introducing Grape, a new dietary health supplement made from the upcycled wastes of the wine and grape industry, backed by the scientific research of my co-founder, Dr. Eli Taco of Cornell University. Before I begin, I'd like to share with you a personal story. Uh, when I was 12, I had pediatric thyroid cancer. And while the treatment cured my cancer, um, it left me with permanent GI damage, and I've suffered ever since. And on a milder note, my co-founder Amber, like many women, suffers from mild food sensitivities brought on by gluten. And I'm sure we're not alone, that there's many, many people in this audience who have similar stories. And that is because we are part of the millions of Americans who suffer from G GI distress. And we are hoping to alleviate some of that suffering. Our target market is an adult between the ages of 25 to 60 who leads an active lifestyle, who is actively seeking to improve the quality of their life, not with pills, but with natural foods. You know, I remember a time when talking about this was social taboo. Now it's being shared by the tens of millions of times. And why? Well, because people are commiserating. Maybe their friend has an answer, or maybe the doctor that they follow on Instagram has the answer. Point is, they're looking for an answer. Let's take a look at the global digestive health market as it stands today. It is currently valued at over $55 billion, with an 11% annual increase. 70 million Americans suffer from GI distress. Of the 70 million, 20 million are, looking, are actively looking for an over-the-counter solution. If just 0.1% were to purchase our product, that would be a revenue of close to $19 million. But you need innovation. And in our case, it's a paradigm shift. Looking with fresh eyes at something that's been there for a very long time. Introducing our hero ingredient, grape pumice. Grape pumice is the skin, the stem, and the seeds left over from the wine and juice making process. And it just so happens that this is the most powerful part of the grape, loaded with bioactives that are going to get you healthy. Gut uh, pumice works on the inner lining of the intestine. And what does that mean? It means it increases your nutrient absorption. So the vitamins and the probiotics that you take pack a stronger punch. It also decreases inflammation. And because it is a very powerful antioxidant, it boosts your immune system. And I don't have to tell you that a stronger immune system means a longer, healthier life. But unfortunately, our story, like all good melodramas, has a tragic twist. Because in New York, we are throwing away 74 million pounds of this every single year. And to add insult to tragedy, the farmers have to pay to get rid of it at a cost of over $1 million. But it doesn't end there. Because once it's taken away, it's sent to landfills. And in the landfills, it starts to produce greenhouse gases. And to give you, to kind of equate how much that is, it's the equivalent of driving over 1 million miles in New York State. And that is a lot of gas. And I want to be clear, this is not a problem that affects our neighboring states. I don't care. This is a New York problem, and we found a New York solution. The wine and grape industry is aware of this problem, and they're actively looking for solutions, as you can see here in numerous trade publications. Now, I'd like to speak a little bit about how, as a company, our collaboration happened. My co-founder, Amber, and I have a CPG company. And we are members, uh, we do product formulation development. And we're members of the Cornell Industry Partnership Program. And we were uh, introduced to Elad and his research um, on the gut microbiome. And because of my particular background, I knew that I needed to bring the talents that we had at Siena to take this research and to bring it into a product that millions of Americans could enjoy. And that's how we came together to form this company. 
And I'm extremely proud to say that we won the first ever Concord Grape Award. Our team is passionate about innovation and research and pushing the envelope. We will continue to do that with new SKUs, new formulations, and new ways just to think about what we can do with this valuable resource. We have a great team of advisors in business, marketing, and, ec and economy. So going back to the grape pumice, how do you get something in the raw state to look like that beautiful powder that you see before you on your left? Well, it's not easy, it's, it's challenging. But our team had the know-how to do it, and we did it. The first thing that you need is you need a very strong, robust supply, ch supply chain, because you are going to re rely on it year after year. And we did that. The second thing we did, we secured a local PUMA supplier that could scale with us. And after that, we addressed food safety. And Dr. Olga Padilla-Zokor of Cornell University graciously provided her time so that we could check all of those boxes. I can now, with a breath of relief, say that we have over 15,000 pounds of pumice in storage right now, ready to launch. Our product after that is blended, and it is easy to use in yogurt, oatmeal. Our original, we've taken out the grape flavor so that you can use that even in your coffee. Where do we stand? Well, we stand apart. In a very crowded field of pills, packets, and powders, we stand apart. We stand between well-defined gut health improvements and sustainable upcycled ingredients. We have a three-pronged gate to deter competition, flavor blending method, proprietary gut health matrix, and micro-encapsulation that we're continuing to improve for solubility. We have a two-pronged sales approach. The first is a subscription model, direct to consumer. The second, and this is true of our original, can, uh, businesses can add this to their existing products for a value-added ingredient without having to go through the expensive R&D because there's, no, there's a neutral flavor to it. This is a very conservative snapshot of our three-year projections. We would be profitable by year two, and what is not being shown on this is year four, and that's where we start our ingredient sales. I want to zoom out from great for a second. I want to look at the industry as a whole. If just 50% of all the great pumice were used, that would mean an extra 128 jobs and over eight million, close to $8 million in revenue. And that is an industry snapshot. We have already accomplished many, many things, including product development, focus groups, prizes, supply chain setup, and pilot runs. Our product does scale. We plan a soft launch uh, based on our waiting list in January of 2024. How will we use the Grow New York money? Well, regardless of the prize money won, we will create high value year round jobs in manufacturing, administration, and sales. With 500,000, we will be able to accelerate customer acquisition and move ingredient sales from year four to year three. With 1 million, we would accelerate that further uh, from year four to year two and create 37 high impact jobs. We are committed to the region. Um, the company is based in Geneva. The research and development happens there. The manufacturing happens there. Um, the re uh, in Ithaca, we have sourced from a local uh, supplier. Uh, we get all our ingredients as locally as possible. We currently are looking at a building in Schuyler County that was once used for the wine industry and would be a perfect fit for us to scale up to. Um, and I want to say something about Schuyler County. It's a county that, whose economy is largely based on um, tourism. So this would pr provide year-round jobs. But more than that, we are tied to the land. We're tied to the vine, and the vine is here in New York. I hope you know by now that with our product, you don't have to choose between what's good for you and what's good for the environment. It has helped me personally tremendously, and I can't wait to share it with you. That is the power of grape. Great for gut health, great for the environment, and great for New York State. Thank you.